Hi everyone, welcome to Ascended Masters 101. This is where we talk all about the teachings of the Ascended Masters. And in this video, we're gonna do something a little different. We are doing an interview. We are interviewing a good number of friends of mine who are also students of the Ascended Masters. And we're asking them if they could describe Elizabeth Claire Prophet in only one sentence, how would they describe her? And a lot of them, including myself, refer to Elizabeth Claire Prophet as mother. So you may hear them saying that. And the reason for that is because she carries such a strong flame, such a strong presence of the mother, of motherhood, that she is lovingly referred to endearingly as mother. I would sum up mother in a few words as loving, kind, disciplined, determined, and very joyful. Mother is the ultimate teacher. She's, she's like a mother that loves my soul. She's my guru. Elizabeth Clare Prophet is a courageous messenger of the Great White Brotherhood and a beautiful example of mother. I would say that mother is the highest representative of the Divine Mother on the planet for this age. Mrs. Prophet is our loving guru in heaven who is helping guide us on our path. I saw mother as being practical, compassionate, and, and the perfect example of someone who loved the will of God and lived the will of God. Mother was determined to obey her masters, and she did. Mother was, is like a personal friend. She's up in heaven now, but she's still a very deep personal friend. That's probably the most special part of Mother. Um, mother is incredibly joyous, was incredibly joyous, fiery, um, very wise, sensitive, um, deeply caring, and very um, inspiring. When I thought about that, I came up with she was efficient. Mother had so much to do. She had so many things that were part of what her mission was with El Moria that I'm just going to use my description for mother is she was very efficient and because she knew that she had a large mission. Mother reconnected me to my true self. She was like a patriarch from the Old Testament that would speak the word of God and deliver it. And it was so liberating to people. And I think that's what drew me to her. Some things I didn't understand, but it was the love and the authority with which she spoke. Um, Mother was a very special soul who, um, well, I believe in karma and reincarnation. So... Uh, have this understanding of her as someone who for many, many lifetimes was prepared to uh, bring information to our planet in our current day and age. And so uh, we call her a messenger. Uh, she provided us with uh, messages from heaven from uh, the ascended masters. And these are people who've walked the earth like you and I. Um, who no longer have to reincarnate because they've become one with God. And so uh, she dedicated her life to providing information about how anyone can do that, how anyone can become one with God and uh, be in heaven forever and ever. A person not able to hurt anyone. Compassionate and a warrior queen, and she was one of my best friends. I think mother was a loving, caring person. She was a, a living example of a bodhisattva, if you can say that. 